Leadership is your instinct, then it's your training. Leaders are always positive, they never complain. I know nothing about technology, I know nothing about marketing, I know nothing about the legal stuff. I only know about people. A leader should incentivize, but not with money. You give trust, respect, appreciation, and correct, heartfelt advice. I always find people smarter than I am. Then my job is to make sure smart people can work together. Stupid people can work together easily, smart people can't. My favorite movie is Forrest Gump. He said nobody makes money catching whales, people make money catching shrimps. So we serve small business. Intelligent people need a fool to lead them. When the team's all a bunch of scientists, it is best to have a peasant lead the way. His way of thinking is different. It's easier to win if you have people seeing things from different perspectives. As entrepreneurs, if you're not optimistic, you're in trouble. So the people I choose, they have to be optimistic. Players should never fight. A real businessman or entrepreneur has no enemies. Once he understands this, the sky's the limit. I do everything to make sure my customer is happy, my employee is happy, society is healthy. I would focus on customers, I would focus on not making money, I would focus on making values. Instead of learning from other people's success, learn from their mistakes. Most of the people who fail share common reasons to fail, whereas success can be attributed to various different kinds of reasons. If you want to be successful, learn from other people's mistakes, not their successes. No matter how smart you are, you will encounter these mistakes and you'll know how to deal with them. When you are small, you have to be very focused and rely on your brain, not your strength. If machines can do things better, we have to change the way we teach. The key things are value, believing, independent thinking, teamwork, care for others, making sure humans are different from machines. It doesn't matter if I failed. At least I pass the concept on to others. Even if I don't succeed, someone will succeed. Before I'm 50 years old, my job is making money. After I'm 50 years old, my job is spending money, helping others, because you can spend all that money. If you want to be successful tomorrow, it's impossible. If you want to be successful a year later, it's impossible. But if you want to win 10 years later, you have a chance.
I always tell myself that we are born here not to work, but to enjoy life. We are here to make things better for one another.